I'd describe the building as aesthetically beautiful, functional but beautiful. One of the concepts here at Winona is that we raise Renaissance women, which are women who are educated across a broad range of disciplines. And we wanted to have a building that reflected that. So we have facilities here that have sport, the swimming pool, the gym, the science labs, the STEM facilities, the learning spaces. We wanted an environment where you could go in and it would reflect that multidisciplinary approach to learning. I think it's great and I really like it. Because it's quiet, because it has a science lab. It's just nice and comfortable and it looks great. Beautiful, fabulous. Probably the biggest smile on your face is because of how they respond. Uh, taking them through the facility and seeing the wows, the U's, the R's, and all the questions about when can we get in, when can we get the chance to go for a swim, when's the gym going to be ready? That's the response that I think justifies all the hard work that a lot of people in the school have put in uh, and the time that we put into making sure this is really going to work for them. So the student reaction is priceless and I can't wait to see them use the facility and, and maximise its benefit. I love all the entranceway, the planting, just that organic feel that you're not walking into an institution. I am most impressed with the way they have made the old and the new fit together. It certainly prepares the senior girls for university. It reminds you of your more modern university spaces and lecture rooms. The West Commons area, the quiet area in particular, in terms of study and the space that they have to learn and do what they do best. We were just talking before about how we've been watching it like be built since we were in, I think, year eight. And it's just so nice to finally be in here and have all the space. And yeah, there's a lot of light and a lot of greenery. And we were, like, throughout the years, we've been involved in certain decisions or, like, being let, like, known what's happening. And it's just really cool to see everything come together, finally. I love the, like, the new gym with all the treadmills and the bike things. Upon opening of the, the Athenian building, uh, Winona opened up the cardio studio, which allowed all senior school students access into the gym with access to their strength and conditioning coaches to enable them to perform at a higher level and also strengthen them physically to enable a higher level of performance at competitions and within the ICSA streams. So the pool's been designed to cater for the performance swimmers uh, along with the community-based athletes. The benefit of the performance swimmers is we have state-of-the-art blocks uh, allowing to replicate starts. Also with the touch pads in, in, introduced as well, allowing us fully automatic timing system. The depth of the pool is two metres the entire way in the competition pool, uh, enabling for deep water training to minimise wave resistance for the swimmers whilst they're in the water with the addition of the anti-wave lane ropes that have been introduced as well. Well, I would describe it as really modern and sleek and fun. Because there's a food tech room where you can cook, which is really fun. Because I love cooking and trying my own food. I like it. I think it's really good for Year 12, especially senior girls. Yeah, there's a lot of senior areas, which is great for us. Yeah. And the study spaces are good. We want to create an environment where learning is valued and loved and that they walk into a space and they want to learn, they want to be curious, they're, they're engaged by what they see around them. And when I look at the girls walking around here and they're in awe of some of the things that they're seeing, I go, that's what I want in all of our girls. I want that sense of awe about life and curiosity about life.